life tips, you're getting beauty tips, you're getting all the things, but that's what you find here on my channel. And that's just what I like to do. Yesterday was my birthday, oh my gosh, and I turned 48 years old, which even just saying that just seems so, so crazy to me. Uh, but I wanted to hop on here today to just speak to you a little bit about aging, how to actually like the process of aging. Yes, it is absolutely possible. And to really give you my five tips for looking and feeling absolutely amazing at any age and to enjoy this aging process. So uh, if you're new here, hello, I'm Tracy. I put out brand new fitness, wellness, and lifestyle videos every single week. So if you haven't already, I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and make sure to give this video a thumbs up at the end of it if you enjoy this. So I am super, super honored because so many of of you have told me here on YouTube and also on Instagram that you really look to me as an example of someone you know that obviously is enjoying the aging process and to kind of help you navigate through that and that just makes me so so happy because you know I'm always here to remind you that today this moment whether you're 25 35 45 65 or 95 Today is the youngest that you will be, and that aging is truly a privilege. So while I was preparing for this video, I wanted to share with you five ways that you can really navigate this aging process and actually like it. <laughs> so before we dive in, I wanna give a huge shout out to City Beauty for sponsoring a portion of this video. By now, you know that I am obsessed with City Beauty, particularly City Lips. I think it's like the best product that is out there. So so I thought it would be actually really fun if while we're having this conversation, I will put on my makeup. So the first thing that I always start with, I already did my uh, sun care, which is what I start with. I live in Miami, so I like to put on, um, I use um, Super Goop, which is unseen sunscreen and glow screen, and I mix them together along with my Indeed, um, what are these called? The Nano Bronze Bronzing Drops. I just kind of make a little bit of a cocktail, I put it on my hand and I put it on my face. It's the only thing I have on my face thus far, um, just because I did that earlier and then I wanted to have this chat with you. Then I go in with my City Lips. So if you haven't tried City Lips by now, what are you waiting for? I love City Lips because it is a hydrating plumper for your lips. It doesn't have that crazy burning sensation like so many other ones do. And I love it because it uses hyaluronic acid and it moisturizes your lips. So I love to put it on two different ways particularly, especially this clear one. I put it on before I put on my makeup like I'm doing right now. And also I love doing it at night before I go to sleep because just like you put on like a serum or a little bit of moisturizer, your lips are important too. And to wake up with gorgeous juicy lips, nothing is better than that. So they are having a buy one, get one opportunity right now that you definitely want to get your hands on. And you know, tis the season for giving. So buy one for yourself and give one to a friend or buy two for yourself and two for your friend. So I'll leave you a link down below. Use my discount code TRACY50. You can use it on City Lips or on Beyond Mascara, which is my favorite mascara and serum together. And I'm telling you, you will thank me later. City Lips comes in 14 shades. This is the clear, you'll absolutely love it. So I'll leave the link down below. And like I said, it's buy one, get one, so pretty amazing, right? All right, so my city lips are on, my skincare is on, and now I want to go into um, some concealer here. All right, so let's talk about aging. <laughs> like I said, today is the youngest you're gonna be. So the number one thing that I would impart to you is to actually enjoy the process. Now, you might say, well, how am I supposed to enjoy getting gray hairs? I don't love getting gray hairs, but you know, I try to be like, they're my hair. It's like wisdom stripes, right? Or getting wrinkles or feeling little aches and pains and stuff like that, right? And I understand that, but here is the deal. Our words matter. So one thing that you'll never hear me say is I'm old. I often don't even say I'm middle-aged, even though I guess technically I am. But really, if you think about it, most people don't live to be 100, so I'm probably past middle age, really, right? Our words matter. Notice the words that you say. Notice how you speak about yourself, right? That is so, so important because our words really do have power. So just check yourself. So here's what I don't want you to do. Be like, oh my God, I say I'm old all the time. Or like, how can you say that, Tracy? You know, but, but 
you can say things like, I'm enjoying the aging process, or I'm 48, instead of saying like, I'm old, you know, oh, when you're over 40. And I get so many comments and messages from women that say like, oh gosh, you know, I'm over 40 and you know how it gets. And I'm like, is that really true? We get to really question those beliefs, okay? So really question your beliefs. Our words have power and I'm telling you, you really can start to enjoy the process when you put your mind to it. All right, where's my brush? Here it is, all right. So I did a little bit of concealer and you saw I just do it under the eyes, in between, around here, same places. And then I always set it with just a little bit of a setting powder here, okay? So I'm feeling the city lips plumping up right now. It feels good, I'm feeling juicy, I'm loving life, all right? So let's just put a little bit of powder. I only powder the places where I put on the concealer, okay? So around my nose, I have this little spot here, and then on my chin and I always do a little extra on my forehead because you know why not um, okay and then I'm just gonna check it because it's hard to do it in a camera <laughs> all right so we are good there so that is done then I like to go in next with a little bit of bronzer because your girl is pale and I like to get tan so the second key uh, to really enjoy getting older and to really look and feel your best at any age is to Know thyself, all right? I was really thinking about this and I was like, why do I think like, even compared to some of my friends, I'm actually enjoying this more and it's not like I have anything different than anybody else has, but it's like, you know, I, I really made peace with myself so much more than when I was younger, you know? Like, I like myself and I know, I know who I am and I know what my likes are. Part of that is also like, you know, it's the, the internal and the external, right? From personality of like what I will uh, accept and what I won't, what is considered a new normal and what is not, you know, what at this age and stage of my life I will welcome into my life and what's just a hard stop, but also even on the external. And so, you know, as I was thinking about like putting on my makeup here today, it's like, I know what products work for me. That's why, you know, if you've been following me for a long time, you'll see I don't really change things, you know, a lot. like. City, City Beauty is a perfect example. I've been using their products now for years. Why? Because they work for me. And when I find something that works for me, I stick with it. That goes for your skincare, that goes for your makeup, that goes for your clothing, right? It doesn't mean that we don't evolve and you know, want to stay fresh and young and try new things. But when you find things that really work for you, that look great, that make you feel fresh, that make you feel youthful, that make you feel confident, sexy, beautiful, whatever it is that you're wanting to feel, stick with it. It. And that's why, you know, I, I joke about it, but it's like, you know, my makeup, when you all ask me like, do a makeup, do a skincare, I'm like, I did one a year ago, it's probably pretty much the same. Some things are a little bit different, but mostly, you know, when I find a brand or a product that I like, I stick with it. And I encourage you to do the same because it's gonna save you time. I mean, one thing that does happen as we get older, right, is that we get busier. I mean, that's just fact, so. All right, so I'm gonna go into a, a cream blush here, which is also a good, you know, youthful tri trick. And I'm gonna show you a way that I do it now, which is different, I look crazy. But you do it like a, like a W, <laughs> okay? And that's gonna give you this really fresh, sort of youthful look. Oh, this is the Nude Sticks, um, the Nudies. And uh, I don't know what color this is, what color is this? I don't know, I'll look for it. And I'll leave all of the links in the comments down below here. And then I just am going to rub this in. I love using my fingers, which is also, you know, such a great tip to look fresher, younger. Ooh, I put too much blush on my nose. That's all right, we'll fix it. Don't worry, everything is figure outable. <laughs> all right, boop, 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 that's a lot. We've got a little sunburned nose, don't you worry. And one cheek is a lot brighter than the other. It all works out, guys. fresh, she is looking dewy, she is like loving life. All right, so we're gonna go into eyes next. So um, moving on here, the third thing that I would say that is so, so important as we get older and to again really enjoy this process is to get the help that you need. Look, you know, you're likely watching this and you're either approaching your 40s or you're over 40 or maybe you're in your 60s. I know I have ladies in my, their 70s and 80s that message me, right? So no matter what age you are, 
we can always get better, you know, and we deserve to get the help that we need. That is just so key. Like, life doesn't stop. You're still living, you're still breathing, you're still here watching this. Like, what a gift that is, right? So if you find that you're struggling with your sleep, you know, or you're um, having a lot of negative thoughts, or you're struggling with your fitness, you know, get the help that you need, whether that come in the form of a healer, a therapist, a coach, a trainer, you know, whatever that is, get the help that you need. You know, there's no uh, metal that goes to you for trying to do it on your own. It just doesn't work that way. So you're gonna save yourself a lot of time, a lot of headache, and increase your happiness by getting the help that you need. All right, next I'm gonna go into mascara, and this is my beloved City Beauty Beyond Mascara. I love this because it is not only a mascara, but it's a serum. So especially as we get older, our lashes get brittle, and normal mascara it actually can cause breakage and cause drier lashes, but not the case with Beyond Mascara, which is why I really think it's designed for women like us, especially those of us over 40 and beyond, because it moisturizes and hydrates. So you get the benefits of mascara, like that lengthening, that volumizing, right? But you also get the uh, moisturizing of the serum inside of it, and it can even help your lashes to grow because they use biotin and keratin in it. So I'm gonna attempt to put this on right now without getting it all over my face, and you will see the difference. I'll do one eye and let you see the other. Can you see the difference between my eyes? the eye that's done and the eye that isn't. I mean, I just, oh, I love this product so much and like, man, does it give you length and volume. Let me see if I can zoom in for you. Look at that. Love, love! Okay, so my mascara is done and I feel like a completely new woman. I love this stuff and it really makes a huge difference. Okay, so we're gonna go in with a little bit of eyeshadow and I am still with the um, nude sticks here this is like a nude cream color cream is always your friend as we get older because it doesn't emphasize the lines and the wrinkles and all the things that we get so I just put it on the outer corner and then I just kind of tap it like that very simple this is like a very natural like you know school pickup look that we're doing here just my normal everyday makeup okay so fourth thing that I would say is make your own rules. Make your own rules as we get older. You know, I had a friend recently who's 10 years younger than me, one of my best friends, and she said, you know, let me see if I can do this. I'm putting a little black eye on tight lighting the top of my eye. She said, you know, do you think I am too old to wear this dress? And she sent me a picture and I was like, what, what, what are you talking about? Like, first of all, and then by the way, I was like, I have that dress. It was like a dress from Zara. Like. No one can say what the rules are. You know, a woman over 40 shouldn't wear a bikini. A woman over 40 shouldn't wear a mini skirt. A woman over 40 shouldn't wear a crop top. Says freaking who, you know? And I encourage you to study other cultures, especially those of us that are American or Canadian, you know, or uh, or, you know, British ladies, like look at other countries and look at especially countries where aging I think is appreciated a little bit more. I'm thinking of places that I go, you know, as much as I can, which is like in Italy or in France and see how the women there, they don't have that mindset of like, well, you know, I'm over 40, so the party's over. You know, I do believe that that is changing here in America, but we get to make our own rules. We get to decide, you know, what does a woman over 40 look like? What does a woman over 40 act like? What does a woman over 40, like, ha like what clothing does she wear, right? So you get to make your own rules. And that is so key and it's so liberating. You're gonna have so much more fun. All right, so I'm gonna take a little bit of black liner here and I'm just putting it on a little angled brush, all right? And I'm just doing this because I'm not great at doing my makeup. This helps a lot. So I'm gonna see if I can do this in the camera. I just kind of lift my eye. Well, I'm gonna do it down here because I can't. <laughs> I lift my eye and I just kind of follow the bottom and that is a big key to kind of lift the eyes, make you look a little bit more youthful, more awake. Um, so I'm gonna do that now. Let's see if I can do it. Oh, I think I did it. Good. I like doing it with the liner on the brush instead of the liner directly. Um, because, you see, it's not like catting it, but it just gives it a little bit of definition 
and just a slight little lift. You can always use your finger, you know, but we're just keeping that angle going here, okay? So we're gonna do that on the other side. You're getting life tips, you're getting beauty tips, you're getting all the things, but that's what you find here on my channel. And that's just what I like to do. All right, let me see if I can do this on the other side. Their eye, she is done. I've got a little clump going on here. I'm not like worried about like looking perfect either. <laughs> Maybe that's a bonus tip for you, but I'm not worried about looking perfect. I'm just worried about, not worried about, but I'm just attempting to look as good and fresh as I possibly can in my own way. You know, I'm not gonna look like a makeup artist. I have a big pink thing in my hair right now. Like, it's just life, right? All right, next up, we are gonna do a little bit of highlighter. Awesome highlighter. Where is it? I can't find it. Maybe I left it in the other room. Weird, hang on. My highlighter was literally right in front of me. Like, couldn't be any closer, and I was like looking for it. That is part of this process, right? All right, and my last and final, you know, piece of guidance for you, or something that I've learned in my 48 years, is that movement causes motivation, okay? This is something that I've been working with students and clients with so much over the last few months here because I know so many women come to me and say like, well, I've just lost my motivation or I can't find my motivation. And especially as we are older, we have more responsibilities, a more full plate. I have that too, right? You know, between my toddler and running my business and trying to, you know, manage my relationship and, you know, having time for my friends and then, oh yeah, alone time and trying to look as good as I can. like. Sometimes when I really think about it, I'm like, oh my God, there's so much on my plate. Like all I really feel like doing sometimes is just like curling in a ball and hiding, right? But when I get into that mindset, I know that movement causes motivation. That's why our daily workouts, those are really like, if you want to reverse your cellular age, move your body every day, right? Because use it or lose it. That's why I'm so passionate about workouts. You'll get free workouts here on my YouTube channel every single week. You know, my ladies inside of TBT, like they get those workouts. Those are like their saving grace, moving their body just 30 minutes a day, right? So movement causes motivation. You're not gonna find it, right? You didn't lose it. Uh, you want to cause motivation and how we cause it is by creating movement movement in our body right uh, movement in our life causes us to become more motivated right and that's really key all right so with it I try patch here with this I'm gonna just put a little bit of highlighter just on top now now we're cooking here where's the cat all right so I did a little highlighter on my inner corners on the bridge of my nose on the top of my lip here now I take the city lip and I just blot it. I usually do it on my arm. Don't do this on your child, <laughs> okay? Because of the hyaluronic acid, it will plump their little cheeks. I've done that before and Luchi was like, plump, and I was like, oh boy. So do it on yourself, okay? So now I'm all hydrated and I'm going to go in with more city lips. Now they have 14 shades to choose from, which I think is so incredible. So I'm telling you, buy one, get one for yourself, buy one, get one for your sister, buy one, get one for everyone in your life. Um, my two favorite shades, I've got this pink taupe. This color I would use if I had like more of a smoky eye. If I want to do a little bit darker with the eye, I would use this color. But one of my favorites that I've used for ages, and I know that you really love, um, you always ask me about it, um, is this one and it's matte, which I love. And um, the color is Rosy Mauve. And it is just the perfect, perfect shade. I love it. So you're gonna see, and also it gives you like big, full, juicy lips. And people are gonna think you got your lips done, but you're like, nope, just city lips. So I'm gonna hook this on. Why do I have to close my eye when I do my lipstick? I don't know, but I do. It also kind of has like a, like a minty flavor, if that makes sense, which I like a lot. Mm -mm -mm. Now, it's very like wet when you first put it on. It's gonna dry in this matte. I love that feeling. So it almost feels like I had a breath mint, which I love. Fresh breath is everything, right? Then I'm gonna put a little bit of lip liner over that, which of course I don't have here, so hang on. So 
that is it. That is what I would do as my everyday makeup. I hope that you enjoy having this little chat while I'm doing my everyday makeup. You know, it's clean, it's fresh, and because there's not too much of it, it's gonna keep your skin looking younger, fresher, more alive, which is really key for us to look great, especially as we get older. So happy birthday to me, and thank you for being such an amazing, amazing part of my community. I love us on YouTube. I love how connected we are. I love getting your comments, and I really do appreciate you. So thank you for making my life just so full and alive and joyful, and I really appreciate us going on this journey of aging together. It's a beautiful, beautiful thing, and it's truly a privilege. A privilege to age and a privilege to do it with you. I also, again, wanna give a huge thank you to City Beauty for sponsoring a portion of this video. Again, this is the time, tis the season, so it's buy one, get one for either City Lips any of their 14 shades or the Beyond Mascara. That's the mascara and the serum together. Get one for yourself, get one for your best friends, you know, just share them. They're great, great gifts. I'm telling you, there really is something for everyone. So just use my code TRACY50 and that will give you that buy one, get one offer. And that's from now until November 28th. All right, thank you so much for watching, for being with me. I truly, truly appreciate you and I will see you on the next one.